Hey guys, in this video I'm discussing Australian phenom point guard Josh Giddy, who played professional ball in the NBL for the Adelaide 36ers. He is an 18 year old point guard with a listed height of 6'8", has a slim frame so he needs to add muscle but I'm sure he will once he gets to the league. Not many can handle the rock the way he does at his height, can really put the ball on the floor. He creates space and panic being a total mismatch with that unique skill set. Will he splash it, take me off the dribble, pass it? Man, he can pass the ball. I'd say his best attribute is his passing. Yeah, you have to respect his scoring, but his facilitating is his number one asset. You were talking about a lamello ball type of playmaking ability. No word of a lie. Go ahead and check out the stats in the same league. Very similar. Both thrive in the pick and roll game. In their respective NBL seasons, both had built chemistry in a short amount of time with their team's best big men, to a point where their tandems looked the very best in the league. Adelaide forward Isaac Humphreys looks set to win the league MVP and be a chance to get into the NBA thanks in big part to Giddy's play at the top of the key. Also quick enough in transition to get down the court and finish strong when he needs to as well. I'd say his shooting has been his weakness but as of late he's shown improvement. For the 2020 and 21 season he shot 32% from downtown which has increased over the season so you've got to be happy with that. In comparison, LaMelo Ball was shooting 25% from three point land last season for Illawarra. Strength in the post needs some work. It will come with added muscle, but it will also take a lots of film study and improved footwork. Once he gets some experience in the post, then it's game over offensively. Same thing with his defense. Once his body gets bigger, he'll be able to hold his ground and fight his way through screens, so I'm not too worried about his defense. He's a hard worker and willing learner, so pair that with his talent and attributes. Under the right system, he could play at all positions on the floor. If given the time to develop these weaknesses, then ultimately I think he ends up being in the mould of a prime Ricky Rubio, but at the height of 6'8". I just get these Rubio flashes every time I watch his games. His feel for the game you can't teach. He sees plays happening before they happen, and his passing is out of this world. I'm excited by this guy. Being an Aussie myself, I've been watching his career super closely, so I'm excited for this upcoming draft. I see Josh being taken in the lottery. Tankathon has him in the 15 to 30 range, but I think he is just too good in all areas to be left on the board past 15. He played in the professional league. His class characteristics on and off the court should see him move up. I'm hoping a system like New Orleans, Golden State or San Antonio picks him up and develops him to his full potential. Anyway guys, thanks for watching. Be sure to tell me what you think about Giddy and which team could use him the most. Comment your thoughts on it down below. Until next time guys, peace.